Oh no, I'm getting stopped by a train. Oh no. Where is it? Oh, there wasn't even a train. What the heck? Okay, that was just make sure. Okay, it's definitely no train. Sometimes you just wish lane splitting was legal in these really hot states. Ugh. Another awkward nod from me. I can't see the light. Okay, there we go. Go cardboard <laughs> box, go. It wasn't a box. It was flap. Go cardboard flap, go. Wow, smells like pee around here. What? That's different. This guy is so cool. He does the finger thing. <laughs> he does it only to me when I go by. He waves to everyone else, but he does that finger thing to me. I have no idea how that started. Uh, there's not even any cars. What the heck? What? There's not even any cars. It just decides to turn red. I should have just gone. Next time I'm just going to go th right through it. <laughs> Seriously, there's nobody even... <sighs> <laughs> oh, it's going to let the person out from the gas station. Nope. Yep. Just for you. <laughs> well, maybe this person? Oh, they're taking a ride. It doesn't matter anyway. Ah, uh, that's green! Yay! <laughs> Oh my gosh, this light is not turning green. What the heck? Uh. See, this one's getting impatient too. They're still waiting. <laughs> see that blue truck over yeah, there? I see that. That was behind us waiting. Now he's like, eh, uh. That light is broken or something. He'll be waiting there for a while. Yeah. He's he, yeah, he's getting ready to go. <laughs> he's do it anyway. Oh, he's just gonna do it. <laughs> <laughs> you know it have been a green light. Uh, yeah, that was definitely a red light. <laughs> he got tired of waiting. <laughs> well, while this light is busy letting everyone else go, when I'm going to be stranded in the rain, I have a question. When is it appropriate? <laughs> when is it, I just did it. When is it appropriate to do a wave versus doing a nod? And like, how do you do the wave? I don't get it. I've been riding for like almost six years and I still don't know how to do the... Dang, that truck is loud. Screw that, I'm out of here. But yeah, I still don't know how to do the motorcycle wave. Like, do you just extend your... I guess I just did it with that biker there. I just extended my arm out, like d pointing downward and just like fingers. <laughs> I'm like going all into detail and stuff. Oh my gosh, it's windy all this wind with engine braking it's like I don't even have to hit the brakes okay now I do oh. but yeah when is it a, like is is there a thing like where you sometimes nod and sometimes wave or do, is it just preference like do you always nod or always wave like I was thinking about it I was thinking if you're going really fast you're probably not going to notice a nod as much as a wave. So I was thinking probably a wave would be better when you're going faster and a nod would be better if you're going slower. Is that how it is? See? Blue sky. Not blue sky. <laughs> Ow, that kind of hurt my neck. I twisted really far without taking my hand off the handlebar. 
Hey, that rhymed. So yeah, the biker wave. Um, is there specific biker waves? Like, if you're on a Harley, or if you're on a sport bike, on a scooter, I don't think scooters do the wave. Oh, I'm on a scooter, I want to start doing the wave. Why not? <laughs> he was taking a picture of my helmet. <laughs> so yesterday I was about to go for a ride and all of a sudden I get on the bike and I'm backing it out and I'm like something feels a little weird and like the the steering was hard it was hard to steer it was hard to back up and I'm like I'm gonna check my tire pressures something's just not right and I checked them and my back tire, I couldn't even get a reading on my tire gauge. Like it was under 20 PSI. It should be 30, 32, 34, but I couldn't even get a reading on it. So it was like, it was so low. So yeah, I was like noticing throughout the week that when I was going around this speed, I kept hearing like vroom, 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 as I kept going faster. It was like the sound of the tire rubbing against the pavement and I, and I thought it was because I just happened to let a little bit of air out of my front tire because I wanted a little more grip for the rain. So I thought, oh, it's just because I let some air out of my front tire it's doing that. But I also noticed when I was making turns, it felt like I had a flat back tire, like I was dragging, not dragging, but it felt like, you know what I'm talking about, it felt like the bike has been just slow to accelerate and everything and so when I found out my tire was really low like that I was like oh that's why that was kind of a cool turn I turned like twice as hard as the car 